In this tutorial, we are gonna learn about various types of gear and their specifications. Before getting started, subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon to get notifications for upcoming engineering tutorials. Definition of gear A gear is a rotating circular machine part having cut teeth or cog which mesh with another toothed part of a gear. A gear may also be known as a cogwheel. Gear is used to transmit mechanical power, change the rotational speed, torque, direction of a power source, and maintain constant speed ratio from one part to another part of a machine. Types of gear There are various types of gear. They are Spar gear, helical gear, double crossed helical gear, herringbone gear, bevel gear, internal gear, rack and pinion gear, screw gear. From these, bevel gear are following types. Straight bevel gear, spiral bevel gear, ipoid bevel gear, meter gear, orm gear. Here, meter gears are also three types. Simple meter gear, ground zero meter gear, ground spiral meter gear. Let's take a brief knowledge about all types of gear. Spar gear. A spar gear is a gear with teeth that project outwards from a cylindrical surface. Two spar gears are used to transmit power between parallel shafts. In spar gears, the edge of each tooth is parallel to the axis of rotation and they mesh together when they are fitted to parallel shafts. Spar gears are the simplest form of gears. Helical gear Helical gears are cylindrical gears with the teeth that are at an angle to the axis of rotation of the gear wheel. Helical gears are widely used in gearboxes because of their smooth engagement when the gears are changed. Helical gears are more complex to make but are much better suited for high speed applications since the teeth engage more gradually than other gears. Double crossed helical gear. Double helical gears are a variation of helical gears in which two helical faces are placed next to each other with a gap separating them. Each face are identical but opposite helix angles. Employing a double helical set of gears eliminates thrust loads and offers the possibility of even greater tooth overlap and smoother operations. Like the helical gear, double helical gears are commonly used in enclosed gear drives. Herringbone gear A herringbone gear, a specific type of double helical gear, is a special type of gear that is a side-to-side, -side, not face-to-face, -face, combination of two helical gears of opposite hands. From the top, each helical group of this gear look like the letter V and many together form a herringbone pattern, reassembling the bones of a fish such as a herring. Unlike helical gears, herringbone gears do not produce an additional axial load. Internal gear Internal gears are the ones with the teeth formed on the inner surface of a cylinder or cone. Internal gears mesh with spar gears. There are two types of tooth shape, one being parallel and the other one with a helix in respect to the axis. Rack and pinion gear. A rack and pinion is a type of linear actuator that comprises a circular gear or the pinion engaging a linear gear or the rack, which operate to translate rotational motion into linear motion. 
driving the pinion into rotation causes the brake to be driven linearly. Screw gear. Screw gear is a screw driven ohm gear, works with a standard screw or threaded rod. Screw gears are used for offset shafts. Whether the shafts are paralleled offset or scoot offset depends on the helix hands of the mating gears. Vevel gear. Vevel gears are gears where the axis of the two shafts intersect and the tooth bearing faces of the gears themselves are conically shaped. Vevel gears are most often mounted on shafts that are 90 degrees apart but can be designed to work at other angles as well. The pitch surface of bevel gears is a cone. Let's have a look on various types of bevel gear. Straight bevel gear, spiral bevel gear, hypoid bevel gear, meter gear, ohm gear. Straight bevel gear. Straight bevel gears are the most common and also the simplest type of bevel gear. They have straight teeth and reassemble a spar gear. Expect that they are conical rather than cylindrical. They also share many properties of spar gears due to the similar tooth shape and the way their teeth engage. Spiral Bevel Gear a spiral bevel gear is a bevel gear with helical teeth. The main application of this is in a vehicle differential where the direction of drive from the drive shaft must be turned 90 degrees to drive the wheels. The helical design produces less privation and noise than conventional straight cut or spar cut gear with straight teeth. Hypoid bevel gear. Hypoid gears are spiral bevel gears where the axis of the two gears do not intersect. The shape of a hypoid gear is a hyperboloid of revelation. The pitch surface of a hypoid gear is a hyperbolic surface, as opposed to a spiral bevel gear which is normally conical. The hypoid gear configuration places the pinion gear of axis relative to the ring gear, which allows the pinion gear to be larger in diameter with more contract area and the pinion and ring gears are always of opposite hands and the spiral angle of the pinion gear is usually larger than that of the ring gear. Meter gear Meter gears are a class of bevel gears where the gear ratio is 1 is to 1 and the intersecting shaft angle is at 90 degree. Meter gears are generally three types. Simple meter gear, ground zero meter gear, ground spiral meter gear. Ohm gear. A ohm drive is a gear arrangement in which a ohm meshes with a ohm gear. The two elements are also called the ohm screw and ohm wheel. The terminology is often confused by imprecise use of the term ohm gear to refer to the ohm, the ohm gear or the ohm drive as a unit. Hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment and like and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you later.